Hello, and welcome back to Spooky Time Gamer. We're going to play Phasmophobia today. I have played just a few rounds of this single player. I'm going to go through it. Um, it's a very interesting game. This came out last year. I haven't been able to try it until now since I've got a proper gaming PC. I'm so excited to try it because it is it has freaked me out. Um, so I'll advise anybody who is watching this, do turn the lights down. Keep the volume up and get ready to be creeped out. <laughs> Especially since it's spooky time, Gamer. This is perfect. Uh, we're going to dive right in. It might be a short, uh, shorter video than normal. Uh, just because I'm going to go through and I don't know how long it'll take me to de detect the ghost here or uh, I might get killed by the ghost. I don't know. So for those who aren't familiar, of light switching. Possibly harmless, but be careful out there. Okay, thank you. So we're kind of like ghost hunters and each house or location has different objectives. Um so Jane Rook is who we are. We have like a mic we're supposed to try to talk to them. Uh these are our objectives. Have a member of your team escape the ghost during a hunt. Ooh, that's not good. Cleanse the area near the ghost with smudge sticks. I don't think we have those. Get a ghost to blow out a candle. Uh, I don't have much equipment right now. The more you play, the more money you get, and the more equipment you get to have. So we're gonna grab just a couple things to start off. Um, there's this right here, which allows us to talk to the ghost. And then this is, of course, our little, uh, what is this? It's a, it's a little meter. It's our little, you know, meter to detect um, if there's a ghost around. So, let's see, how, how come I cannot grab the keys? That's weird. Hold on, hold on everybody. I don't know why I can't grab these keys. All right, now I got it working. I had to just change a couple buttons around um, to my liking. Let's turn this on. And so, it, you see the little, there's the little mic icon right by the FM? That's how I can actually talk uh, or try to talk to the ghost. Hello? So we get to come in here and it's really creepy. Let's see if the lights will be working. All right. Hello, Jan Rook. Oh, I already heard a door open. Jan Rook, are you there? Jan Rook, are you with us? I mean, it's just, just like in the ghost shows, right? Jan Rook, are you with us? Jan Rook, are you with us? Put 
that down and we keep doing it. Jan Rook, are you with us? Uh oh. You want to, the idea is to search the house and then detect anything weird happening. And you have a whole journal once you start getting, uh, I guess, readings to kind of check. Jan Rook, are you with us? To compare and see if there's like, uh, if it matches any of the ghost descriptions. Ooh, creepy basement. Oop. I heard a door. Is there a light switch down here? Hello? Jan Rook, are you with us? Of course, I left it without turning on. The light. Where's the light switch? There it is. That going. Ah, much better. And I'm just double checking to make sure I'm hitting the wrong button so I can talk. I'm talking. Local V. Yeah. Or B. Jan Rook, are you with us? Jan Rook, where are you? No, oh, I heard a door open. Okay, so there's something that way. Might be in the garage. Might be in the kitchen. Might be right here. Where, where is the, where are you opening the door up uh, here? <laughs> All right, let's close that. All right, so we've got, okay, so it must be, must be around in this area. And no, not a high EMF rating uh so let's get some more tools let's, let's go find out what else we can get uh from it so we've got a couple things there so we know it's kind of like in that kitchen area possibly um and there's my activity you have to keep up your psychology or your team sanity up or else you'll go crazy and uh you get hurt let's see what do i got still in my inventory let's uh, grab this and the uv flashlight let's see if there's any handprints then we can start uh, figuring out if uh, what kind of ghosts we've got going on. I'm not going to turn off the lights, though. Ooh, ooh. I said... Oh, great. The lightning kicked the lights off. Alright, so we're going to have to go into the creepy basement. Oh, look, see, there's a handprint. Oh, come on. There we go. But yeah, I'm going to try to get Bob from uh, pause button to play this with me. So we can both, you know, get scared. Ooh. Okay, so that door just opened by itself. You saw that, right? Okay, okay, okay. Let's um see if we can get them to write something here. Jan Rook, can you write something here on the book? Can you just doodle something? It'd be very helpful. Okay. You know. Ooh, 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 ooh. Right there is a new handprint. Maybe the haunting's in here. Okay. So. 
<laughs> Let's just get over here for a second. All right, we'll look at our journal. So, um, evidence. We have fingerprints. We did not have that go up. I haven't seen if there's any ghost writing yet. It did not go up to level five, so we don't. It's not that. I haven't checked for ghost orbs, so I need to see if I, I probably need to go get the camera. Let's uh, let's check on if there's any writing. Ooh, there's lights flickering in here though. Hello. So what? The yeah, hello. No, no, I'm not here right now. All right, let's see if there's any ghost writing. Right there. Okay, we're gonna let that. Sit there and see if she'll write something for us. Maybe if we go back over here, we'll get another response from her. Jan Rook, are you with us? Jan Rook, are you with us? Close that. Oh. oh gosh, that scared me. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Ooh, I love this game because it's so freaky like that. Jiminy Christmas, I got chills and I got a jump scare. Man. Oh. Hooray and bravo to the developers. That's just me panting because apparently I can't run far. See, ooh, look, my, <laughs> my sanity went down. Let's see if we can get some orbs on picture here. Um... I guess she kind of responded. Let's just check her journal. This is like a safe zone. Uh, temperature didn't change. I don't have anything to de detect temperatures. Nothing from the spirit box. Let's leave this, because we already know that there's... Um, we already know that there's a, a handprint. So let's get some of our other tools and figure this out. Right now, I'm just trying to get the basics down as I play this. Um... Hello, I don't know if I opened you. That way, um, I can eventually buy some better gear. Let's see if she wrote down anything over here. No? Really? Quit opening doors! We're gonna, we're gonna put this right here, maybe? Okay. I don't know how that works properly. Uh-oh. We had a little flicker there. Make sure our exit's here, because what happens is if they'll appear and they will kill you. <laughs> Ooh, what was that? Take a photo here. You can go back to the van or the truck and see if anything's happened. I guess I can keep saying her name and see if she'll come out. Jan Rook, are you with us? Jan Rook, give us a sign. Oh. I guess that's kind of a sign. Jan Rook, please come on down. You're the next contestant on Are You Haunting Me? Me. Right, right, <laughs> I played this once and it freaked me out because the ghost appeared and had already closed like all the doors so I couldn't escape. It was standing there so I was really worried about it, you know, getting me because I'm trying to earn points here. Um Let's drop this. Let's see. It moved this. It moved this. Okay, so Look, we've got some evidence. I don't see any orbs, though. This is so cool. This game was like a small team. It's independent, and they were able to do all these really cool things with it. It's got night vision on it. I don't know how to turn the night vision on. Let's see if I can put this down. Oop. Not quite. I 
I really don't want to go back in the basement. <laughs> oh, I should though. Let's see if I can survive. Did we check on the book? Let's see if there's anything here yet. No, no writing. Be nice to have some sort of... Some... Oh, I thought I saw something. Something happen. Let's see here. Jan Rook, are you with us? Jan Rook, give us a sign. Jan Rook, show yourself. Jan Rook, stop messing with the lights. Jan Rook, where are you? I don't know where she is. It sounds like it's like this way. Maybe it's this way. Well. I don't know what other tools to use. Jan Rook, give us a sign. Jan Rook, where are you? Alright, I'm, I'm just gonna leave. Haha, <laughs> safe! Let's check our journal. No ghostwriting. It's like, I need more stuff to figure this out. And so it could be, like, any of these things. Now, we did- it did talk to us, so let's just, uh... Let's go through, um... Let's see, what's phantoms do? So you can get double check. So a banshee, fingerprints, ghost orb, dots, projector. None of those. Spirit box, fingerprints, projector. It didn't do those either. Ooh, it's Jim. It's a gin or okay, gin. EMF level five, fingerprints, freezing. Well, I don't even have the the temperature thing. What's a Mimic. The Mimic. Hmm. No ghost orbs, I don't think. The lights are flickering, though, so maybe if that was an evidence. Poltergeist, it hadn't thrown anything. Uh, what's a miling? Hmm, 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 hmm. Very vocal and active ghosts, rumored to be quiet when hunting their prey. Wiling is known to be quieter. I thought... Wilings more frequently make paranormal sounds. Well, they keep slim. I want to say it's that. Even though I couldn't get any of the other stuff. We'll, we'll, we'll stop back in there and just double check, but I want to say it's a Wiling for now. I'm probably off base, but I don't have anything else to really test here. Jan Rook, give us a sign. I'm out of here. Bye, Jan Rook. All right, that's going to be it. All right, let's get out of here. 
All right, let's see how we did. Oh, load, loading game. Welcome back. I prepared some jobs for you. Great, not much XP. Uh, I might have to spend some money and get some other equipment in here because this is really hard to do. Welcome back. So yeah, this is our uh, headquarters. Definitely different from when I remember. I watched people play this like in the, I guess, early release last year, and it was so cool. It was like it was very bare bones, and really, even though it was bare bones, it was so well done. Um. But here, look, you can see a ribcage I collected from <laughs> one of my one of my outings. There was apparently just a ghost that left a ribcage up for me, which was so nice. All these balloons are out here just to celebrate that I, you know, welcome to the new office. Um, because they, they, I guess they've upgraded the office. So let's see things we have. Um, thoughts projector. I don't even know how that works. I need to look up how that works. Um, but we need a shop. We need to buy. Uh, let's see. Buy one of those. And we don't need sanity pills. There's a smudge stick. Parabolic microphone. That costs a lot of money. Uh, and I don't know if it actually... D if it takes away things. If, uh... If you leave it there or not. Saul just talks to the most kinds of ghosts and will reveal their footsteps under UV light. Ooh. Let's get some of that. And, uh... uh yeah, we'll buy a tripod. Alright, cool. Alright, let's, let's go for another round. Let's see. We'll do the same house, because uh, a lot of these places are really big, and I'm not ready for that. Um, well, let's see here. What's 10 and 2, 10 and 2, 11 and 2. Let's well, do 13 Willow Street. Let's try that one. Get ready up. Um, where's all the new stuff we just bought? Hold on. Let's make sure we got all of our stuff. Add. Add. I think that's all I bought. We oh, yeah, in the tripod. Add that. There we go. All right, let's try that. Let's go in. And I hope you're enjoying this. And if you haven't already, like, subscribe, and hit the bell notification. Take a look at the equipment and prepare accordingly before starting the investigation. <laughs> Response to people who are alone. Oh, look, we got a daily challenge, so I got an extra 50 bucks. That's nice. Survive a haunting phase. Ouija board ghost type. Okay, so yeah, there's lots of fun stuff you can buy. Get an average sanity below. Okay, I don't think I'll be able to do that. Can't cleanse. Escape the ghost during a haunt. Or a hunt. Okay, so... Let's, um... Start off with this. That, so we can see where we're going. Or do I even need that? Hold on, let me drop this real quick. Okay, I do need that. And, um... This. Okay, we'll, we'll start here. Alright. Now don't get too scared. <laughs> Sorry, I need to take a sip of my beverage. I've already forgotten the guy's name. Let's go back and double check his name. Sorry. They do such a good job with the sound design. That's like snowing. That's so cool. 
Donald Taylor. Donald Taylor. Donald Taylor. Donald Taylor, are you here? Donald Taylor, where are you? Donald Taylor, where are you? Hello, Donald Taylor. Donald Taylor, where are you? That's interesting, okay. It was five degrees over here, wasn't it? <coughs> Excuse me. Wait, was there already a slam? I need to close these doors to make sure I'm not making up stuff. Donald Taylor, are you here? Getting cold. I wonder how low it has to get. Donald Taylor, give us a sign. Oh, there's a light switch over here for it. Who makes a basement and doesn't put a light switch right there? Donald Taylor, where are you? Are you here? Whoa, this is cold. Real cold. Right in ooh. I don't think it's supposed to be that cold down here in the basement, is it? Yep, no, it's not supposed to be that cold. Alright, so we found, I think, the room of haunting here. Let's see. Donald Taylor, are you here? Nothing on the EMF. But this has got to be the spot. Alright. Get some more equipment. We'll be right back. I'm glad I got that. Oh, so we're right here and slamming the doors. Donald Taylor. There was a way to list the things that I had done. Okay, so drop that, drop that. Take this, and let's take that um, while we're here. Okay, journal. Ghosts. Evidence. Freezing temperature. Okay, so we've got to knock down to those. <laughs> All right, here, hold on a second, everybody. Okay, we're back. Sorry.
No, not down in here. Well, yeah, not here. Let's close this. Definitely seems the haunting's down here. Donald Taylor, are you here? See if we get him to write. Donald Taylor, show yourself, please. Donald Taylor, please respond. Donald Taylor, are you with us? I could put it right here. Oop, no, nope. didn't mean to do that. Nope. You. There you go. Donald Taylor, are you with us? Donald Taylor, are you with us? Donald Taylor, are you here? Yeah, let's get more gadgets to double check to see where he's at. Might be some handprints, so let's get the UV and, um, I guess the dot thing. Which I'm still, I still don't understand how that works. Maybe there's a little thing somewhere that tells me. Oh, let me double. We can double check while we're getting getting it from here. Let's see. Grab you and grab you. All right. Let's see. Journal. The items. First possessions. No. Oh, what's say about tools? Digital camera tracking movement smudging. Laser grid of light that can reveal the silhouette of a ghost. Oh, that's creepy. Okay, so that's what that's for. All right, now we've got our UV light in our normal light, and we've got the dots projector, so let's uh, see if we can see if there's any, uh, I guess, fingerprints. I'm happy there's not a storm going on where they're messing with the lights. Oh, goodness gracious, when did that show up? All right, we've got human evidence. <laughs> Journal. Ghost. Evidence. Um. Okay, I don't know how that goes into there. <laughs> Let's see what, which one of these leaves me like human remains or something. All right, well, they haven't been aggressive and they haven't attacked, so it's not that. The Morori or Roro. I do like how they have different uh, legendary creatures here. Risen from the grave to drain energy from the living, they have been known to place curses on victims. The weaker their victims, the stronger the Morori becomes. Mori it might be that. They had the freezing temperature. No ghost writing, but we're going to check. And the spirit box wasn't. Okay, I don't know what it, which one it. Oh. Okay. Let's let's see what we can find down here. Did all the lights go off? No, it just seems darker. Can we turn a light on in here? Make me so much happier. Ah. There we go. Too bad there's not a light for right here. But did, okay. Let's see if there's any handprints anywhere. There hasn't been really anything been moved, though. So, it's not like it's a, it's moving objects. So that should... Oh, I was like, there's a silhouette. So that should show a silhouette if there is one.
Donald Taylor, are you with us? Uh oh. That is a yes. Um, let's uh, <laughs> let's regroup and get out of here. Oh wait, can I get my thing? You know what? I'm just gonna leave that. Actually, nah. Yeah. I'm gonna take that with me. Thank you, uh, Donald Taylor. We're 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 gonna scooch out of here. And if I need to get more evidence, I will. But man, <laughs> oh boy! All right, let's see here. Actually, you know what? I I can't do that inside the house. I need to do it out here. We're safer. Whoa! Nope. Oh, they're really mad now. Donald Taylor, are you with us? Donald Taylor. Donald Taylor. Donald Taylor, hello. Are you mad? I just want to talk to you is all. Donald Taylor. Okay. Let's see here. Journal. Evidence. Well, we had the dots go off. Okay, so it's not these. A Yuri or Oni? Huh. The spirit box did seem to go off too. Okay, so it wasn't... Okay. Let's see. Ghost says return to the physical world usually for a purpose of revenge or hatred. Yuri's have been known to have a stronger effect on people's sanity. Okay. Uh, I didn't see any ghost orbs. And the other one was... Oh, an Oni. Onimusha. Well, we didn't get an EMF level at all. Oni is loving scare victims as much as possible before attacking. They are often seen in their physical form guarding their place of death. Oni are much more active. Wildest people are nearby and will drain their sanity faster than manifesting. Oni disappear less often while hunting their prey. Okay, well, here, let's check our sanity meter and, um... I think it's going to be this. But let's uh, let's go back in here. Let's check our sanity meter because I'm sure that had have spiked it pretty low um, while we were in the basement. Uh, well, no, it well, knocked it down pretty far. That's for sure. Um, let's see. Let's see if we can get a couple ghost orbs real quick, and then and then we will get out of here. I'd be a little sad if we didn't get to see this guy. Even if he kills us. Donald Taylor, are you here? 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 Donald Taylor, are you with us? All right, let's go take a peek at those. Just make sure there's not any orbs, but I think I think we've got our ghost. I really do. Ooh, the sanity went down further. So dark down there. Um. Hello. Let 
wonder why there's strings attached. Maybe it's just for effect. I mean, I don't see any orbs, so... Oh, well, 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 let's just say that's it. Okay. Alright. Thanks, Donald Taylor. Let's see if we're right. Loading game. Welcome back. Oh, we weren't right. Crap. Ghost type ride you. Well, f oh, we survived a hunting phase though. A hunting phase. That's nice. Okay, yay! All right. Well, that's gonna be it for a spooky time gamer. Like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, and I'll catch you on the next episode. Thanks.